Ah, the good life. You are kicked back at the beach, soaking in the sun after a refreshing swim in the surf. It doesn't get much better than this. You reach into your bag to get your smartphone to check to see if your buddies have arrived for the weekend. Wait, you did put your phone in your bag, didn't you? Suddenly you realize you never took your phone out of your swim trunks when you decided to frolic in the waves. Frantically, you pull it out, look into the dead black of a screen, and hit the power button repeatedly. Your life was on that phone. Now what are you going to do? Faced with the possibility of the end of your mobile life as you know it, you take your phone to the local repair wizard, who then promptly tells you that trying to turn it on shorted it out. Great. The phone will have to be replaced. Frantically, you tell him that you will give him anything to get back your data. He smiles and says not to worry. He's got a guy who can do data recovery for you. Cool. But wait. What exactly is data recovery? Well, data recovery isn't repairing your damaged device. Though certainly having your device working can solve the problem. However, what if even if your device is working, it resets itself or loses part of its information? What if you accidentally delete data? Data recovery is all about finding your stuff so you can get back to work, back to life, and avoid getting killed by your significant other or boss. Data recovery, though it may look like magic, isn't. Sorry, Harry. Data recovery does require some technical savvy, some state-of-the-art tools to talk to your device and to get it to give it up its secrets. Some of the tools used in data recovery include the UFED Touch Ultimate, Microsystemation's XRY Complete, and Oxygen Forensic Suite. These specially designed tools, when wielded by a trained and competent examiner, can get you back your data quickly and painlessly. So what exactly can be recovered? It turns out just about anything that can be stored in your vice is a candidate for data recovery. A lot of people will be concerned with phone call logs, text messages, and their contacts. However, the list does not stop there. In a data recovery operation, we may be able to recover deleted voicemails, pictures, videos, emails, and information stored in apps, plus a wide range of other data, like geolocations or user preferences. However, this isn't a guarantee that we are going to be able to recover your data. There are a number of factors that can influence the success of data recovery operations. Some of these include the length of time that a device has been submerged in water. The type of water is a factor as well. Seawater and pool water cause more corrosive damage because of the amount of particulates in them. The amount of physical damage that has occurred to the device, whether it is electrical, heat, or physical trauma, can also influence the success rate of data recovery. Finally, the use of the device is one of the more insidious recovery influencers. In general, the higher the use of the device before being brought in for data recovery, the less likely it is you will be able to recover lost data using standard means. This does not mean that all hope is lost. There are advanced techniques such as JTAG or actually physically removing the memory chip from the device to read the data off of it that have been successful. These techniques are in most cases destructive to the device but have been known to have a 95% or better success rate in obtaining data. Using these advanced techniques requires a bit more technical know-how and certainly more technical devices than the industry standard tools. Simply put, the data recovery expert has become a miner of precious stones, seeking to recover data diamonds, rubies, emeralds, and sapphires, with the ultimate goal of sorting through the digital jigsaw puzzle and putting ones and zeros back together into a whole picture so that you can have what you need when you need it. So whether it is physical, water, or electrical damage, or simply deleting the wrong file, the goal of data recovery is to keep you out of this. To put this on your face again.